What's up guys? It's me, Jeannie, and it seems like prequels are the new sequels these days. They're even doing it in video games like Tomb Raider. After the older games and Angelina Jolie movies, they're going a bit old school and giving us a bit of background on Laura Croft in the latest Tomb Raider game. The game didn't do amazingly well, but that didn't stop MGM from partnering with GK Films to try to revive Tomb Raider on the big screen. Why? Who knows? Hollywood's out of ideas. It is too soon to say how well this Laura Croft video game to movie translation will go yet because they haven't hired a writer, director, or even a new Laura Croft yet. Some people are throwing out names like Olivia Wilde or Camilla Ludington to replace Angelina Jolie as Laura Croft, but I'm thinking Jessica Biel would be a really great choice, Elijah Dushku, she hasn't done anything in a while, uh, Zoe Saldana would be an awesome Tomb Raider, I think, and Rosie O'Donnell. Anyone else think Rosie O'Donnell? Some people are clamoring for Megan Fox to reprise the role of Laura Croft, but that's not gonna happen. She's already turned it down, probably because she's too busy ruining the Ninja Turtles movie. All right, so that's all we know about Laura Croft right now, but give us a thumbs up if you want us to keep you updated on the new Tomb Raider movie. I'm Jeannie, subscribe to Cinefix, or else Megan Fox will ruin all your favorite movie franchises. Get your film fix. Subscribe to Cinefix.